There's three days left until Christmas break at Bonneville Elementary. And the ribbons decorating the front of the school are not for the holidays. This is a very peaceful neighborhood. People have a lot of respect and kindness for each other. Parents, students and neighbors tie pretty pastels and sketch hearts on the sidewalk, sending the message everyone is welcome here. We have people putting up ribbons to just for love to just kind of celebrate the love that we have in our community and love that we have for other people. The community support comes after vandalism Saturday night where criminals spray painted every side of the building with all kinds of hate speech and images. The type of hate speech that was used uh, ranges everything from homophobic, anti-Semitic um, hate speech as well as racist hate speech. And also language directed toward people with physical disabilities. Brent Weisberg with Salt Lake City Police says the department is concerned. They've seen a recent uptick in possible hate crimes. No word if it's all connected. A few weeks ago, we had someone spray painting uh, hate speech at the Utah Pride Center. We also had someone stealing uh, pride flags from the ballpark neighborhood. Then we had that hate crime directed potentially at that Asian owned business. It's just uncharacteristic of this neighborhood. That's not who this neighborhood is. What the neighborhood is, is a community choosing to combat hate with love. That's the only way to stop it, really, I think. Hate with hate just begets more hate. Police are working with the school district to look at what these security cameras caught on the building, but they're also asking anyone who lives nearby to check their own home security footage. And if you see anything that might help the investigation, call Salt Lake City Police at 801-799-3000. Reporting outside Bonneville Elementary, Emily Tenser, Fox 13 News, Utah.